It's opening night of Oktoberfest at River West Festival Park. The German festival promises days of activity. News on 6's Lex Rodriguez joins us live with everything it has to offer. Lex. Jonathan and Tatum, Oktoberfest brings a little piece of Munich to Tulsa, including food, music, and of course, German beer. Well, just look around. Uh, there's a great combination of, uh, you know, being out here with family and friends, first and foremost. <laughs> enjoying music, enjoying good food and drink, uh, and doing so in great Oklahoma weather. No, you don't have to dress up, but that's part of the fun. You know, lederhosen and dirndls. You don't have to go all out if you're not in a performance. Uh, it's still kind of warm, but I mean, grab a chicken hat, grab a felt hat. Uh, get a dirndl. Everybody loves a good dirndl. I'm just enjoying myself, uh, loving some beer, loving the Bavarian music, uh, all, all, seeing everybody out in costumes. Uh, the parade's about to start, so I'm excited for that as well. We've made additional investments in some of the infrastructure out here, so people may notice some of the food booths that we have have a more authentic look, uh, more alpine in nature, uh, which you might see in Munich and other festivals in Germany. The food has been really good. I haven't had any yet, yet this year. Last year, uh, I had some of the strudel and it was probably one of the better things of the festival. Oktoberfest is Vunderbar! Oktoberfest runs through Sunday with free admission tomorrow from 11 to 4. Live in Tulsa, Lex Rodriguez, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6. And a reminder, there is no parking at Oktoberfest. Instead, organizers say you can park at several locations around Tulsa and take a shuttle to River West Festival Park.